So I'm lucky enough to get to take another trip. Back to Puerto Rico for the third time. We're gonna help some people get some power. All right, first things first, breakfast, all right? Who are these guys? <laughs> Come here. Yo, where do you go? Come here. There. All right, now that we have lunch. With, without your soul, they sing it. And then another 13. From the hole to crawling. From the heart, from the smash. Put my trouble mind in the swimming dirt. Luis got the battery working. Here's all the Batrium uh, long mons, watch mon, the expansion board that we're not using right now. And this is all connected via Wi Fi. And this is shunting right now. This, it's burning. All the, the red lights means that are burning energy from the groups of cells that are on balance, right? They're too high and it's trying to match everything to this one and to this one. So there's two that are not shunting. Everything else is bringing it down. And that is connected to this Schneider uh, that is six kilowatt inverter uh, just to serve as a load right here. Internal resistance. And, uh... Okay, so here's a whole pallet of these modem ones. Look at these guys. It's uh, 11,000 cells right there. Ready to be deployed in Puerto Rico. You got yourself? I got myself. All right. You got yourself? Yeah, I got myself. All right. Are you ready to get wet? Oh yeah. Okay. There we go. Ready to go. <laughs> hey. I'm gonna shoot as much video right now because once my camera gets wet. <laughs> okay, so we're in a kayak and I might fall in. Line up and face us side by side. Bioluminescence. Bioluminescence is simple terms means like produced by a living organisms. Their size is one five hundred of an inch. Look like a soccer ball with a mini skirt on it. We got it underneath the tarp there. Yeah. Be very careful. We have had incidents in the past. This night we want you to be very safe. So we survive. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, my friends. That means you are all gonna drift away and you will die for sure. All right, guys. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. But for real, keep holding on. Even. Yeah, I would uh, imagine. Oh, this water is gross. I'm sure if I So this uh, kayaking trip here, expedition. It's so you can see a thing called bioluminescence or some type of organism in the water that when you shake it, uh, you wave your hand, it'll light up and we should have been able to see it. But it turns out that due to the storms, due to the contamination, due to a bunch of other factors, you can only see about 10% of the bioluminescence this night. So I couldn't really get it on camera. Other than that, this was actually pretty fun to kayak oh, wait, at night. In the ocean.
Next morning, we got the opportunity to go uh, to an island offshore of Puerto Rico. It's a tiny little island with 2,000 people uh, and it's got one of the best beaches on the entire Caribbean. So I'm in the middle of a little island called uh, Culebra, uh, just outside of Puerto Rico. And there is a Tesla Powerwall here. This is the island that Tesla brought a bunch of power packs uh, to help the, the about 2,000 person population in this little island. So this is a private one that is to, you know, to power this house where we're staying here. Um, and this is a, I think this is off the grid. I think this is like a self-sustained home. It's got PV on the top, it's got a battery, and it's a small little villa, just, you know, right at the beach. Pretty cool stuff. How do you, how do you sleep at night? We're gonna see old San Juan today. So old San Juan is pretty amazing city with this colonial architecture and its cobblestone streets. You, you might have a problem getting out of the island. Oh, oh well. The thing Please. is that they're closing. How am I staying with you guys? Now I grew up listening to this song. En mi viejo San Juan, cuantos sueños forjé. So to be here in this city is pretty special to me. Now one of the big attractions of old San Juan is the fort called El Morro. It's at the very tip of the island and even though I've been here three times, I hadn't seen it yet. So this time around, we decided to go all out into it. All right, let's go check out what the go check out the, pee -pee the guard oh. tower actually looks like. Oh, I was gonna go in there, but I don't know. There's something to the poor weekend. Clean it up. That's a restroom. That's not a guard tower. That's it a restroom. What it used to be. I'm gonna put one of these. One of those? Yeah. Don't do that. One. No, they have one. more value than what you're gonna do. Oh, what was that? Oh! How dumb are we? We're just throwing money. Yeah, don't throw your money. Just give it to me. <laughs> uh, another day at the beach. Just for a little while. We just have an extra hour that we can kill, and we wanna do that.
And just like that, our week-long visit to the island ends. Now this time around, our project moves from just being able to help a few families to the possibility of making a product that can help countless families power their home, not just in Puerto Rico, but also in the States, as they are talking about uh, making this product available in the States also. Now, I feel very fortunate to be able to add some value to these two parties involved in this thing and this venture that's happening here, right? But keep in mind that just because I am mingling and rubbing shoulders with these, you know, giants of industry and, you know, and hanging out in their, you know, private beach homes uh, means that I am, you know, making tons of money off of this. You know, it's not very clear if and how I will be able to benefit financially off of this, this deal, right? And so, the challenge for me to be able to figure out how to monetize these videos so that I can keep making projects, so that I can keep doing these trips and, and show you guys interesting and important projects, uh, it's still very much the challenge. So if you if you like what I'm doing and you feel that I've earned your support, you know, there's a ton of way to really help me. You can donate directly to my PayPal account, you can become my Patreon, which uh, will allow you to you know support me in small amounts on a monthly basis. But by far, the, my most favorite one is when you decide to do a project and you order uh, supplies, batteries, you know, cables, boxes, using my links on my videos. Every single one of my videos has links on the bottom and sometimes even here in the cards and stuff. And so if you click on those, if you buy anything on Amazon, if you buy anything on eBay, if you buy batteries from Tom, you know, I get a small, small percentage of uh, commissions. And that really, really helps me keep going, you know, creating projects, doing these trips, uh, shedding light on some of these, you know, important projects that are coming up. So if you feel that I've earned that, I you know very much appreciate all your support. Uh, to all of you, my patrons, and all of you guys that have support me in some way, shape, or another by sharing, liking, subscribing to my channel, all that stuff, it's really, really helpful too. Uh, I wanna say thank you. And with all that, I say thank you once again, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.